the Duke of Sussex has revealed the six words that Philip said to him before his military career took him on a tour of Afghanistan, and Harry has reflected on the conversation with his grandfather Prince Philip said six words to Harry before he began his tour in Afghanistan that have stayed with him ever since. The Duke of Sussex reflected on his late grandfather and his ability to listen during a new BBC program Prince Philip, the royal family remembers. Prince Harry, 37, revealed the Duke of Edinburgh gave him space to speak about his time in the military without probing. He spoke candidly about the royal, who passed away on April 9 this year at the age of 99. While remembering his unwavering support, Harry recalled Philip's reaction to his military career and six important words he told the young royal before his tour. Going off to Afghanistan he was very matter of fact and just said, back quote make sure you come back alive. Then when I came back, there wasn't a deep level of discussion, more a case of, back quote well you made it. How was it? That's how he was, Harry recalled. He was very much a listener. He sort of set the scene for you to be able to share as much as you wanted to share, but he would never probe. The prince served two tours, first as a forward air controller, during 2007 to 2008, and later as an Apache helicopter co-pilot gunner in 2012 to 2013, while his grandfather served as a naval officer during World War II. The father of Ta later honored the military connection he shared with his late grandfather during his funeral, which saw Harry wearing military medals. During the BBC program, Prince Philip's son Prince Charles also spoke of his father's dedication to the military, with the Prince of Wales remembering how his father took very seriously the fact that he was involved in the three armed forces. Well he took very seriously the fact that he was involved in the three armed forces, and obviously the navy was his main service, but he took an inordinate interest in everything to do with the other two, Prince Charles said. He read up an awful lot and thought about it, and so he certainly put a lot of the generals and others through their paces, if you know what I mean. He'd always thought of a better way of doing it. While Prince William said, he's always set a very good example about how we have to look after the welfare of the military, and represent them, and be there for them, and understands, you know, the trials and tribulations, that they all go through. The BBC show, was originally meant to mark the Duke's 100th birthday, but has now been adapted in tribute for Prince Philip following his passing. The Queen did not take part in the interviews, but granted special access to her private film collection for the documentary.